everyone and welcome back to more Grand Theft Auto 4. Now I've had to hang up on Roman trying to call me, had to hang up on little Jacob. I went and got a burger because I was hungry and you know if you just stand still in GTA, you guys, you'll know this. Like, it's just carnage. Nico, it's Roman. I was talking to Brucey. That droid monkey? He is a good friend of mine. He'll be a good friend of yours too if you let him. Anyway, he's got some work and we are in need of money. Meet him at Brucey's Executive Autos on Mohanad in East Hook. If Mallory calls you, we are bowling together. See you later. Okay, so I think I actually... I heard that already. So I think these calls that I am getting are the same calls I got in the last episode. So we're not exactly missing out on anything. Come on, run away, man. Right, right in front of the pole. Like, good job. For God's sakes. Out of my way. Thank you. So yeah, I remember how awkward the driving was when I first started this game. It's still awkward. <laughs> um, oh, sorry about that. Damn it, I lost my bonnet and everything. Fuck this. Is that an ambulance coming for me? It's not coming for me. So you know how I told you guys that I, I was going to the pain clinic and they were going to make everything better? Well, they didn't. And uh, they didn't give me an injection or nothing. Nothing at all. So nothing new to report on that front. Just drugs, 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 drugs. Hey. Uh, Kick him. Hello. I'm busy. I said hello. Ow! Motherfucker! See, me and Nico, around. man. What you do that for? We is get on so well. Around. Yeah, he's around. Brucey, some fucking Polak asshole for you. Pleasure is that racist? To meet you too. He's not a Polak. He's a gentleman. Still a fucking asshole. Sorry, Nikki, man. How's things? Okay. Sweet. <laughs> I got you, man. I'm big, but I'm also fast. Wake up, boy! Ooh, I'm Holy sorry. fuck, I thought he... I thought he was gonna punch him. <laughs> oh, ah, oh, enough, man! Enough! Oh, oh. Fuck me, be man. All right, huh? oh, that's some Red Army shit, serious. You gotta show me that one. I'm all about power. Come on, touch my backs, man. No, thank you. Rock hard. I bench 450. I'm a, uh, no more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should probably get your should, teeth should sorted as well, because well, they are Roman bright. Said maybe Very you need bright. Some help, and we need some money real bad. Shit, my bad. Yeah, of course. Love that guy. Love him. I mean, I am no chubby chaser, but if I was in a queer, that guy would be in trouble. You know what I'll I mean? let them know. <laughs> hey, I'm shitting with you. Brucey likes pussy. Remember that, all right? Okay. Okay, right. so if I find you Listen, on the website, I'll just I know you swipe. Guys need money yeah? Back. Okay. Yeah. This ain't a nice job. Not exactly mom and pop shit. No problem, as long as the pay is good. Sometimes people fuck other people over, okay? And the people that fuck other people need to get fucked with, especially people that go into hiding before they can get on the stand and put a lot of guys inside for a lot of time. What? I need you to whack some people, only they're in hiding. How do I find them? Man, you're cold. You didn't even blink. I know. Love usually, that. Nico's Fucking like, nah, nah, nah. nah I, I refuse to be your hitman, but not this man. time. Not really. All right, Brucey. I'll give you a call. Ice cold, man. Ice cold. Woo. Yeah, I'm surprised. I'm hurt by Nico on this one. Nico, you're turning into a cold ass killer. Okay, let's get in this. Oh! Oh! But there is just something about him. Okay, I need a police car. So, uh, hi guys. Hey. Hey. How can I run this many people down and not get, okay. Really? Whoa! That was just... Your right, like that was. How do you even flip a car like that? Anyways, so yeah, I know what to do. I just need to piss some people off. Um, 
Gandhi's gonna do it. Gandhi's gonna do it. <laughs> yeah, no steroid injection for just now. Um, still on. Oh, there we go. Medication, and I'm just trying to live my best life, and that's all I can do right now. Down here, sir. Oh, hi. Okay, there's two of them. Ooh, my game just lagged a little bit. Are we okay? You need to get out the car! Oh yeah? Whoa, I don't, wait, I've got three stars? What did I do? Uh oh. What did I do to get three stars? Oh, we're about to make it worse. Whoa! Fucking hell. I just want the car! Oh my... Something. I was thinking of a foreign word to say, but it might be offensive. So, oh my god. <laughs> um... That's right, you have to then do the mission again. Okay, it's fine. We can... Just go into our messages and it's totally fine. So how are you guys doing on this fine, uh, you know, oh, holy shit. I am recording this on the 22nd of the second month, 2022. And in your lifetime, unless you freeze yourself and go into the future, it's possible. You will never experience this ever again. Never. This is it, you guys. Tomorrow, we fucked. So, I need to get a cop car. Right, you deserve to fucking die for that. This is the one that's got all the ammo, so. Don't call me baby. Love it when you make it. Okay, one dead. I don't want three stars. Like, that's where it all went wrong. I just need one. I don't know why they thought that I was that much of a danger to society that they needed three. It's, it's a bit excessive. Okay, so it takes a while. Like, you you do a crime, and then they come, like, a little bit later on. Well, I guess that's realistic. Hopefully it just stays at one. Listen, I don't have time for messages right now. Just need a cop car. Do the dinosaur! Don't bust me. I literally thought I was about to get three stars! Okay, fuck. I thought I was about to get Busted. That's okay. I don't want to pull over. I just want to dance like it's 1999. And I would have been 10 years old. Does anyone remember the Millennium Bug? Where we all thought that when we turned to the year 2000, that everything electrical wise was just gonna break. True story. Look it up. Um. Trying to lose three stars is a bit trickier than. Ah! I know, right? Really annoying. Okay, they're behind me. I'm 
I'm thinking, like, where could I go? Oh, shit. If I just keep going forward, I might be okay. Okay, we're out. This okay. Revis. Oh man, I'm feeling chills down the phone. Call me when it's done, bro. Alright. Oh shit. Okay, nothing on that one. Lyle Rivies. Hey baby, what's the word? Um, I forget. Lyle? Okay, drug trafficking. Hey, oh, I got him! God, they wish it was that easy. <laughs> In the real world. I mean, I would know I'm an expert. Duh. So, I've done a bit of shopping yesterday, which I haven't. You know, I'm a hermit, I haven't left my house. Since other than yesterday. Um, Christmas? <laughs> I'm just thinking, like, and I'm talking not like picking up your groceries, obviously, because we gotta live. But yeah, like, I haven't actually done anything. I think a lot of it is COVID. I've never had. COVID. I've had my vaccines. I didn't get my booster because I didn't want to. I wasn't feeling very well with my face. So I was like, I just, I just don't want it. Um, but yeah, I feel like COVID has kind of stopped me going out as much as I would usually. Okay. Hey, it's me. So he's up, okay. Better be awake, I'm about to kill him. I feel kind of well, bad Lewis, though, like this I got isn't the message my problem. From Brucey for you. Brucey? I thought he was fucking joking. Shit! Motherfucker, making a run for it. Of course he is. That's fine. You don't kill a man while he's peeing, okay? A fucking course. Listen, I'm gonna kill you in my cop car, okay? Because I worked really hard to get this. Fuck, I'm coming for you. You make a run from me. You didn't do me no harm, but you, you bad. You, you. <laughs> Come on, police car. I thought you'd have some NOS in here or something. I have a tendency to look at the map a lot when I'm driving. People always say like, why do you crash all the time? And I'm like, well, I mean, I look at the map a lot. I was gonna say, I'm gonna run out of that ammo pretty soon. Really? I think I was gonna die. And then it did this. Um, okay, place your bets now. Am I about to die? Cause that, and should I just keep driving through? I don't fucking know. I'm gonna drive through. Uh, okay. Nailed it. See, I fucking drive through it. Nice! This car is done for. 
<laughs> you should not worry about the Rivas anymore. Thanks, though, man. A lot of people are going to be very grateful that certain people fuck with them. They can't drive this. The other people are fuck with anyone anymore. If you get it. I get the money you're paying. You're all about the cabbage. I mean, the lettuce, the lettuce. Ice cold, man. I love it. There'll be some more work when you need it. That was fun. I really enjoyed that mission. Give me your taxi, please. Can I borrow your vehicle? What are you doing? I'm just borrowing it. Wait, is there a number on this? I'm in no wait. Top hooker. No, there isn't. Yeah, like the game wants to like auto save every time I do a mission. I didn't put that on, actually. I just want to see if I can turn it off. Just, I don't mind it saving after the mission. I don't mind that, but. It's the fact that... Okay, so if I turn that off... Then I don't know how to save it. Well, I guess I would just have to go into, uh... The houses and save it. Sure. Sure. Yeah, why not? I'll come over and pick up within the hour. Yay, I got a friend. You got a friend in me. This taxi is quite nice to drive, huh? There are two messages. Oh, that's right. Dimitri wants to talk to me. Lame. Because I don't want to talk to him. My floor is shaking. We don't get earthquakes where I'm from. Although we did have an earthquake in the UK. I think it, that was yesterday, actually. So, you know. All these people that are like, global warming isn't a thing. And I have had the worst weather recently. Um, like, the fucking worst. You know that Outcast song? I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. I am for you. And in the music video, they're in a house and um, they are constantly like just getting buckets from the rain. That is me, or has been me, the past couple of days because the weather has been that bad, you guys. Like, I shit you not, it's been just awful. Absolutely awful. Can I go this way? Because I feel like I'm... <laughs> I'm getting further and further away and I keep forgetting to do that thing where I can just put a waypoint on and it'll take me. Why am I like that? I just keep forgetting that that's a thing. Yeah, my house has been taking a battering. I think it's different, like, see if you live around people, then other houses can kind of shelter you a little bit. I live by myself in the country in the country so the wind the rain everything just batters my house and it's sad because i get upset like when my house is having issues <laughs> mainly because it costs a fortune to look after a house like my house is a hundred years old i bought it because it's huge um but when it actually comes down to looking after the house, I mean, it's old. It's gonna fall down at any moment. Skizzy. Skizzy. I mean, it might not fall down, but you know. All right, come on you, let's go get drunk. Let's go us down. Uh Rock one Rasta. What's up, Jacob? Why is good for some quality time here? Yeah. See? Yes. And all work, 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 you know? We gotta ease up from time to time to see how the world turns on. You know what I'm saying? I think so. The world can mess you up, you know. Make you think that things matter when all that matters is that the sun come up and we have a good time and laugh and things. See? I hope so, man. I do. You're up building on acre, even for a shutter. This guy is so nice. All right, we have to look see what kind of craziness them have tonight. Please. 
Alright, what are we doing in this place? Alright. It's very quiet here. It's kind of awkward. Welcome. It's very quiet. Like there was we no have atmosphere. Two great acts coming up. First, the incredible climax. Hey girl. Welcome. I am constantly asked, Kleinman, when did you discover you were magic? Have you ever used your powers for good? Like making cancer patients or nuclear warheads disappear? One man even asked me, can you make my masculinity disappear? But I am here to entertain you. Not your body, curious fantasies. I will now make my assistant float. Oh my god, he's gonna I chuck her in the air. Gravity. I will be the master of Isaac Newton. Now arise. What? Been smoking. Ah, yes, I can make this filthy woman fall under my dominion. Oh, arise. Yes. Eat shit. Oh, oh, Laurel, Laurel. Oh, 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 oh you're a quadriplegic. Uh, oh, don't worry, everybody. Uh, she's probably only a paraplegic. Now let's hear it for Miss Bluesy Saint John. Welcome. Welcome to Mama's Little Show. Yeah. Yeah, play it, Al. Play it. Al's a fine piano player. Pre-recorded because his union got a little mouthy and greedy, so we sing to his CD now. But I still feel like he's here in spirit. I have a little song I want to share with you. It's about something that's happened to us all. No, no, I'm not talking about getting sandwiched by two Lebanese train porters in the caboose. No, I'm talking about losing your baby. You know, they get picked up by a stranger on the way to go to school. And then you grab a bottle of gin down from the dusty cupboard where you put it. And you wake up in the sterile belly of a spaceship. And a man comes over and looks like your father. And you realize that day your dad disappeared. He didn't leave your mom for the fat bitch at the gas station. He was abducted. And your captors put you down in a farm field late at night somewhere in Iowa. And they painted patterns in the corn. And the crickets are singing. And the cows baying in the distance. And your backside hurts something fierce from the probing. Woo! And the Holy Ghost is there, too. Man, the Lord has a ghost. And there's a girl on a swing set, and you go push her off the swing. And you know what? We're all that little girl sometimes. Sometimes life pushes you off the swing or makes you a little girl, even when you're a little boy. Well, that's all I've got time for tonight. I love you all. Thank you so much. Good night. Miss Bluesy Saint John. She was very good. She was mad. Jump me on my man. I wonder if because I've got the music turned off. That's why it, there was like no atmosphere. Like why it seemed like it was very awkward. Alright. That was fun and I... What I really like about this game is actually getting to make friends and interact with them and go to shows and go bowling and go to my cluckin restaurant and just all of these things like it just makes it it makes you appreciate the characters. I feel like in a lot of the other GTAs other than San Andreas anyway, I never really appreciated the characters as much, but 
In this one I do. Oh. Oh, that was too much. But yeah, like, so if anything was to happen to them, I'd be like, no. We went to the show together, no. And I'd be really, really sad. Don't be beeping your horn at me, thank you very much. Yo, go see you in our Rasta. See you, buddy. Like, he wasn't happy with me because I turned him down. But I was doing my intro. So I was just like, well, you're gonna have to wait a little minute, you know? Right, I wanna go to... Well, B is closer on the map, but we did just do his mission. So let's go and see Dimitri. I can't wait to get a really, really decent car in this game. So, this is a pretty big week. It's the Elden Ring week. Now, I have no idea how Elden Ring will do on this channel. Like, could completely flop and I'm left with a 30 hour game that I'm like, well, I'm enjoying it, but no one else is. <laughs> I just feel like I never know how games like that will do. Because I've been excited for it for a long time, but it's whether or not... Because like, we build up quite a big GTA audience on this channel. So I don't know. The Master and the Molotov. Dimitri. Hey. Sit down. What is wrong? He's really not okay. What's the problem? What do you think? Mikael. Mr. Faust. Uh-huh. You're given a choice. Kill your best friend or die. What do you do? And there is no way out? Not now. Not after you killed Petrovic's son. You don't have any family. You could run. Wherever you go, people will find you if they want to badly enough. And for this, they want blood. But you and Mikhail, you have so much history. Sure. Well, I killed the boy. So they want me to? No. I told them you were a hired gun. And they said, as long as you were the one to kill him, you'd be spared. <laughs> so that's the way it is. Yes, that's the way it is. Is that true, though? He'll be leaving his house in a little while and heading for the club. Do what you have to do. You know, if there's one thing I've learned, it's that we must obey the rules of the game. We can pick the game, Nico Bellic, but we cannot change the rules. See you later. God. Oh God! Um. All right. Not sure how I feel about this one. Sorry if I'm fidgety today. I hurt my back doing some exercise yesterday, and uh, you know I've come to realize in my old age of the thirties, exercise is bad. Okay, like Mr. Garrison style of. Extra bad. Okay. And uh, I don't like it. But you need it to stay fit and healthy. But it hurts. It's like, why would you choose to hurt yourself? They didn't see me, right? They saw me. <laughs> yeah, it's like your muscles are. 
are so sore. And I, I get the whole concept of working out. Like, it's good for you. Holy shit, I looked at the map. There we go. Ipsies. I'm running now. Sorry. Fucking hell, dude. Look at that. Look at that blood. You, lady, out the car. Those who want to survive, get down. Okay, I really gotta even lose this wanted level. I'm not around. Okay, I think if I go this way, I'm gonna come out of it. Okay, that's all you're gonna do. You're just gonna park up and pretend that you are parked up. So yeah, my back is killing me today, so I am super fidgety. I do like to feel strong though. I love to dance. So when I'm dancing and giving it all, when you slut drop, if you guys know what that is, right? Uh, <laughs> you gotta have like muscular legs. So I like, oh, oh wait. So I like to have muscular legs. There we go. There, I said it. I don't know how I feel about this mission, but here we go. Don't know how I feel. I might ignore it and just sit on my phone. I mean, he is losing his marbles. should have got a new outfit. Maybe I'll get a new outfit after this. Body armor. I mean, I know what body armor is. Fuck. Do I have to? I guess I got it. Hello? Hello? Okay, I guess I got it, but not that way. I just psyched myself up too. I was like, right, here we go. Okay, here we go. Let's do this. Hey, honey. Nico. Nico Bellic. You and Dimitri are taking over, no? This is not about taking over! You brought this on yourself! You pushed things too far! You would be dead if it wasn't for me. That is what Dimitri wanted when you killed Vlad. Dimitri... My brother. You see this? This statue says we are brothers for life. And now he betrays me. You didn't give him a choice. <laughs> you should have been calm. No one, not Dimitri, not anyone tells me to come. You think Dimitri would have survived prison without me? He'd just be some prison queen had I not been there. Meet for some gin monkey! I am not dead yet. Some are still loyal to me. Guards! Oh shit. I'm going to fuck you your fight like a worm, like spineless worm. <laughs> you are nothing. <laughs> Man, I need you! Kill him, I'll kill you! Did I get him? Shit. You don't get down there. I can take out this motherfucker, right? 
about this. Now. Go, go, go! Get up and stay down. I'm gonna take all your money! Not the other way around! America made him greedy! Dimitri will turn on you as well! You shall discover this! I am a man of conviction! I have only done what I believe! None of you will survive in this country without me! This American greed takes everyone! It's like it is. Do I have to kill him? I gave them everything, and they took everything. You should have stayed away from a man such as me. How, if I survived that, how did you not? Faustin is dead. You did a good thing, a hard thing, but a good thing. Hopefully, this will mean peace with Petrovic. I I don't trust anyone for the record. Um Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Right. What we do know is I am an expert at launching myself off of buildings. Like a parkour queen. What is that? What it Oh! Pidgey! You're in the wrong game, son! You know, I couldn't. I just couldn't. Whoa! Ow! Yeah, you better run! Son of a bitch. Okay, well... Uh, that was a good mission. But a sad one at the same time. But I will be honest with you guys. He lost his mind. Like, we saw the way he was treating his wife. We saw the way that he was just talking in general. Um, I'll just wait for him to contact me. That's the thing. See if that all turned out to be shit. And Dimitri just used me to do that. I'm gonna be pissed. Okay, I'm gonna be pissed. I wanna go see Brucey. Hey, my girlfriend lives there. I think he knew that he had gone too far, that he was crazy, and glad this is not my car. maybe it's just something that had to be done, but I just, I didn't like the way of it, really, where it's like, oh, you have to do it now because you killed that guy, and la da 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 Gotta turn, gotta turn. Fucking hell. I really need to learn the handbrake. Wait, should we find out? Cause I'm, I'm getting like, I want to know. Dimitri, you got my money? I have it. Meet me at the warehouse of Magomed in downtown Broker. Come along. Who would I come with? Like, I don't have any friends. Sheesh. Why do I feel like the, this is the start of uh, going to a different place now? All right, my brother. Me and them Russian and seriously vexed with you. I only pissed off one. He's dead. I'm going to meet Dimitri to collect on the hit. Yo, Nico, you better watch your back, you know. We know you're wicked, but them boy, them are some dog ass. I'm not afraid of him. Yeah, what I can't see, I can't leave it, you know. Yeah, come with you. Where's the place? A warehouse on Mohane. I know the one. You see around the back. You fucking know it, my man. Wait, his meeting isn't... Ah. Well, hopefully I can still do that, because this seems pretty important right about now. This strikes me as we're getting ready to go to another island. Sorry, I was not looking at the map. It's funny though, like, we just killed him for you, but we don't trust you at all. Okay, let's 
see. Short bodies, huh? You don't know. I'm a bit seeing star. Hey, Nico. Glad you can make it. Yes. You got the money? Sure. But I just wanted to say how grateful me and my bosses are for what you did. Good. Yes. And I just wanted to check something with you. Okay. You are Nico Bellic, correct? Excuse what me? What is this? And you used to work the coast in the Mediterranean, smuggling people into Italy. I don't know what you're talking about. But you messed up. And left a lot of bad debt. You left a good friend of mine out of pocket. Big time. Hello, Nico. Hello, Mr. Bulgarin. Ross, where is our money? I don't know. I didn't rob you. Really? We were busted a mile off the coast. I had to swim for my life. I don't know what happened. I nearly drowned. Jacob, get in my here. Heart was bleeding. I did my best. I didn't fuck up. Well, there you are. Ah! Ah! Fucking hell. Get in here, Jacob. Oh, sorry. Your lucky day, punk. You are dead, motherfucker. Oh, look. A mission that didn't quite go as planned. I don't want to go forward just yet. Fine. Here we go. Also, long as no one throws a grenade. How many more people? Listen, I don't care who Nico is, okay? I feel like I'm gonna have to move to the site, maybe. Yes, fuck that one. people I actually do trust in this fucking city. Insane. 
And then fucking silence. Did I get him? Okay, another one down. Another one bites the dust. Uh. So I'm actually thinking that by having uh, auto aim on, it's not helping me. Okay, maybe it did. <laughs> Cops are here. I just gotta kill these fuckers. I am not getting busted. Get in, dude. Let's go. Okay, it's only two. I've managed to lose a three before. I'm trying to fucking lose them. No one fuck up the game back there. What went wrong? I don't fucking know. I can't think about it now. I need to shake these fucking pigs. Man, I'm just a whole man down. You're right to stay in a nico. Um, listen, I think we got a lot of explaining to do, but not right this second. Really not right this second. It's so funny because it's like, it's like the slowest car chase that you've ever seen. Okay, so my memory card was full somehow. I don't know how because I'm pretty sure it was empty when I started, but... Anyways, I don't know when that went off. Um, yeah, sorry about that. Right, let's go. As I was saying, it's like the hey, slowest. I kill, I get gone, I kill. Wait, can I stop here? So the slowest car chase you've ever done. Go away, go away. No, you lose Babylon, man. Power back in the cafe now. Yeah, I need to block up some more. I want to know, like, what what was that all about, Nico? I the was a snake in the grass. I didn't know that Mr. Bulgarin was here in Liberty City. If I could have killed them all then and there. Just chill, Nico, man. One at a time. One, one cocoa filled basket. See? We find out where Dimitri's then. Bam! We take the rest of them all. Just keep your head down until then. Fucking Dimitri. Made me kill Faust and then he sell me down the river. Just go, Nico. The boy is a general, you know, see? 
You're gonna make us one downfall. Now I had a monkey climb the more I'm exposing bad boy, you see it? I will bring Dimitri down myself. I promise you this. That's what I was saying, like... He played such a good actor when he was like, Oh, it's so hard, like... You know, killing my best friend. What an awful thing, like, I really don't want to do this. And it's like... You're a piece of shit. You know, I'm so angry. I don't know where my memory card says it ran out. But, uh... Of course it did it on one of the main missions. Right? Of course. You keep on alone. Call your woman and get out of this place. Hey, thanks for your help, Jacob. One love, my brother. That's what I'm saying. I think we're ready for the next uh, city now. Oh, but I can still do the B mission, which is good. Right, let's tell Roman... I think he deserves to know. Roman, what are you doing? Why are you whispering? Well, I'll be there soon. Oh my god, again? Roman! He's in a bin again, isn't he? Why is he chilling in a bin? You guys know what he is like. I do. I think I'm getting it with the driving. I think it just coming from playing Vice City and then GTA 3. It was just odd at first. Oopsies. And I agree that it is very realistic, and that's kind of what they've gone for. Yeah, it was just difficult to go to that from playing the older games, which they are very, like, fast-paced and just all of that, you know? He's in a bin again, isn't he? Roman! What are you doing? See if they have him! Roman! Roman, where are you? In here! I'm stuck! Let me out! Shit, man! <gasps> what are you doing in there? I got scared. People started calling the house and hanging up. You weren't answering your phone! What happened? We've got a big problem. Dimitri was not a man of his word. So we're dead? More or less. Everything was fine before yes. you. Yes. Fine, and now this! Thank you! Thanks a lot! It's Veni! Nevid, what's done is done. Yes, but there's a bigger problem. What? That guy I owed money to, Bulgarin. Yes, the guy in Europe, who lives by the Adriatic. Yeah, yeah, he's here now. Great. I'm sorry. I've ruined your life. No, don't be like that. We, we can find a way out of this. Bunch of idiot Russians. I will kill every one of them. No, that's exactly what you won't do. We don't have time for revenge. We can't afford it. What can we afford? Uh, we can lay low and start over. Please. Come on. Let's go back to the apartment. Isn't it so funny, though? We can pick up our stuff and then get out of here. That... I'll call Mallory. She might have somewhere we can hide out. Yeah, it's so funny that Nico is just like, I killed them all! And Roman's like, for God's sake, like that's kind of what got us in this mess. Let's know. Let's think logically. We're not just going to murder hey, everyone. Um, listen, me and Nico are in a bit of trouble. Um, need to get out of broker a few days. Any of your cousins have a place we could use out in Bohem? You're an angel. Beautiful and kind. I love you. We'll see you there. Maybe things are not so bad. This I did not expect. I was thinking about getting out of the cab business. Last night I had a dream. Really? Yes. You and I had a place of our own. A place where people come to eat and relax. Classy place. None of this fast food diner bullshit. We're in a real restaurant. 
Place, uh, distinction, you know? I can't see myself settling down. Not now, but in the dream, you met the right woman. She's beautiful. You're like my Mallory. In the dream, Mallory and me are married. Everything is perfect. This could be the start of that. A fresh beginning. All I know is we have to get... What the hell? <gasps> what? No. I've got to go in. I've got to get something. Like Leave what? You're not going in. This place is gone. They burnt it. They fucking burnt it, Nico. Yeah, we're fucked. Um, dude. Do you know how long it took me to get the place of my own? You got out the boat and I was here for you. I know you were. I got here and I had nothing. Nobody. I worked my way up from the fucking dirt. I feel so bad. Roman was right, though. Wait, Jesus our business! Fuck! I've got nothing left. Not my home, not my business, nothing. I took it all. I'm sorry, Roman. I'm really sorry, but we have to go. We'll meet Mallory and Bohan. You still have her. And you, for all the good you've done me. You know, I don't actually trust. Mallory. Because, I mean, she was happy enough to you fuck Vlad. To get Vlad, sorry. You don't, because it was easy for you. You had it all from day one. It took me months to get some cash together. Finally, I bought a cab, and then another. Then I got the depot. I slept under my desk at that place for over a year. Then I got the apartment. The apartment you thought was so shitty. Well, it doesn't matter. And now it's gone, along with everything else. I said I was sorry. You have a lot to apologize for. Since you got here, I've had my computer smashed, I've been beaten up, I was kidnapped, and then shot in the stomach! My apartment got burned down and so did my business! Things have been going so great, just great since you showed up! You remember that time when we went to the bar back home and found it raised to the ground? Just a pile of rubble. Everything smashed, except for that one bottle of vodka. Yeah, we sat down and finished it off there and then. Wait, wait, I don't want to talk about back home. We're here in America now. And I should be thinking about my life here. My life, which is ruined. Just drive, shut up, drive. <laughs> and the other one. What's up? No, what do you mean? I haven't been crying since my allergies. <laughs> Nico's wearing this new cologne. Yeah, trying to impress Michelle or something. They're coming to your cousins. Are you there? Great. See you in a bit, Bill. My dream? It was just that. A dream. I can't have the tavern now. I have nothing to buy it with. I, ha I have nothing. I told you. You still have Mallory. But I wanted to really have her. I wanted to marry her. You can still do that. I had bought her a ring. That is what I wanted to show you. It was a beautiful ring. It was... <laughs> <laughs> now I have nothing. <laughs> Come on. Oh. Roman, pull yourself together. You've been here before. Positive, mental attitude. Come on. <clears throat> At least they want me dead and not you. <sighs> I do not think it will be much difference to them, Nico. One dead Belik will give them a little bit of happiness while they wait for next. I do not care, though. We are in this situation. We must deal with it. Bring on the Bohan. Okay. Oh. Here we are, the beginning of our new lives, again. God, everything has gone to shit. Roman was right from the start. That's quite nice. It's got a plan. You know. Not so bad. <laughs> I mean, I don't think we'll be impressing women with a wonderful hot tub, but uh, this looks okay. Yes, great. Come on, what's what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Where should I start? All right, I'll start with you. What's wrong with you? Fifteen minutes ago, you were cowering in fear because you didn't know what was going to happen. Now, you know everything is shit, and you're going to be killed, and you're all cheerful. I don't get it. I guess I'm an optimist. An idiot, not an optimist. 
I was bought a broker anyway. I'm glad you turned up and made some Russian killers burn down my oh. home and business. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Nico. Thanks a bunch. Is that better? March! Thank God you're okay. Both of you. We're fucked. We're broke and on the run. No, I'm from up here, Nico. I know a bunch of people who might be able to help out. Why don't you come and meet me at the community center later on? I gotta go to work. Bye, Papi. And have a shower. You smell a little, um, mature. So, I guess we start again. Sure. I'm going out. I'm like crying on the inside here. Like, I'm very, um, I got a lot of questions that I know the game will answer in time, but I, I've got so many questions. I don't trust Mallory because of her involvement with Vlad. It takes two to tango. I feel like Roman was right all along when we killed Vlad. But in the same breath, like, it kind of had to happen, you know? Aww. He's just, he is such a good friend, oh my god, I swear, if he double crosses me, I don't know what I would do, because I think that little Jacob is just, he's so good. And he was there, you know, he came out, guns blazing, pew pew pew, like he was there, you know, when he was down, when Nico was down, little Jacob was there, and that... That means a lot to me, okay? It means a lot to me. This game is phenomenal. Oh man, it's so good. Now, as I said, I will be playing Elden Ring when it comes out this week. Um, but don't freak out. Doesn't mean that um, that's it. GTA 4 is gone. Like, I, I love this game. And depending on how Elden Ring does anyway, I'll probably just post GTA more. Anyway, because I love this game. And I don't want the story spoiled, you know? I can't have that. This cannot happen. As always, make sure you are subscribed to my channel for more. It means a lot to me. We're on the road to 40k. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And I will catch you all in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Bye.